I would like to nominate C.C. Rhodes for the top 50 nominations because he found the uh, not only because he found the diamonds in Africa because he changed the, the destinies of uh, indigenous people in Africa. In 1871, Rhodes and his family moved to South Africa, Cape Colony. His father was a government officer and he had the proper education. But he saw the uh, African kids who doesn't have uh, proper education and proper nutrition, also a proper income. So, uh, after he became the Prime Minister of Cape Colony, he decided to change this. But it was not easy because uh, the budget of Cape Colony wasn't enough to do that. But lucky for um, African people, in 1893, he, he and his team found diamonds in Johannesburg, uh, South Africa. And uh, he eventually started his uh, company called Anglo BRC and his multi trade company called uh, Dubby's Group. 46% of those groups and 46% of the profit of that companies went to a charity uh, which made the proper education system to uh, African people. Still those charities are uh, still those charities are active and anyone can donate. Also still the companies are donating his Anglo PLC and his uh, Rabies group are uh, donating to, to that charities. Uh, after Ceci Rose and his team found uh, found diamonds in South Africa Af uh, the price tag of African lands were increased in the world market which was uh, which was a huge bless to Africa and uh, today his companies were on the top rankings and thousands of African people young people were are working on his companies and today now now Africans have a proper education now they have a proper uh, income now they have proper nutrition because of cc roads also uh, when zambia in 2012 when zambia was on uh, when zambia can't pay their loans to china the only company that helped them was anglo plc because their founder cc roads uh, cc roads was kind-hearted to african people and those companies are still uh, working on the rules that cc roads have invented it is incredible to uh, think that there were people like Cecil Roach who uh, dedicated to develop uh, the future of a nation that she, he or she doesn't belong into and that is the reason I think uh, Cecil Roach must be in that in, in that list